866 Ron Zero Fez. 866 Ron Zero Fez. It's a Friday. It's going to be a nice weekend weather wise. And then I'm actually looking forward to next week and how quiet it's going to be around here around 202 without a couple of grab assers around to cause trouble. Just drop it. The fact that there's going to be a little suspension next week. You will not be hearing a live Opie and Anthony show next week on XM202. That's because they have vacation. Uh, they have suspension is what it is. It isn't. You want to check on Opie and Norton uh, during their vacation? Yeah. Check the fucko list because that's where they're at, my friend. What list? The fucko list. You stole that, too. That's not even yours. I. you have anything that's yours anymore? Yes, I do. Of course I do. You don't want Fuzzy? I have my dignity now. Yeah, you do. I'm going to tell you something right now. You're going to end up destitute. You keep starting fights with everybody, and before you know it, people are going to churn on you, and then it's going to be the end of you. Oh, that is not, that's not the way it's going to happen. The way this was resolved with Norton and Opie not here next week on suspension, I feel a validation, Ronnie. It's a validation of my humanity. It's, you know, everyone thought, oh, okay, you know, Opie takes some privileges. Fez will be out the door if he causes any trouble. Yeah. I'm still sitting here. I'm the one who survived. First, I was afraid. I was petrified. Kept thinking how I could never live without you by my side. But then I spent so many nights thinking how you did me wrong. And I grew strong. And I learned how to carry on. And so you're back, huh? From outer space. I just walked in to find you here with that sad look upon your face. I should have changed that stupid lock. I should have made you leave your key. If I had known for just one second, you'd be back here. Oh, B. Oh, go on now, go. Walk out the door. Just turn around now. Cause you're not welcome anymore. Weren't you the one who tried to hurt me with goodbye? You think I'd crumble, Opie? You think I'd lay down and die? Oh no, not I. I will survive. Ugh. Oh, as long as I know how to love, I know I'll stay alive. I've got all my life to live. And I've got all my love to give. And I'll survive. I will survive. Hey, hey. Who's standing here now? Who's the plaything now? I'm here, Fez Watley, survivor. Fucko list is where you're at. Take that. Took all the strength I had not to fall apart. Kept trying hard to mend the pieces of my broken heart. And I spent oh so many nights just feeling sorry for myself. I used to cry. Now I head my, hold up my head up high, what? you see me, on 202. I'm not that chained up little person still in love with Hughes. And so you felt like dropping in and just expect me to be free. Now I'm saving all my loving for someone named Anthony. Go on now, go. Walk out the door. Just turn around, Norton, because you're not welcome anymore. Weren't you the one who tried to hurt me with your pain? You think I'd crumble? You think I'd lay down for monster rain? Oh, no, not I! I will survive! Oh, as long as I know how to love, I know I'll stay alive. I've got all my life to live, and I've got all my love to give, and I'll survive. I will survive! Oh! Go on now, go! Walk out the door. Just turn around, Norton, because you're not welcome anymore. Weren't you the one who tried to hurt me with all your pain? You think I crumble? You think I lay down for monster rain? Oh, no, not I. I will survive. Oh, as long as I know how to love, I know I'll stay alive. I've got all my love to give, and I've got all my life to live, and I'll survive. I will survive. I have survived. Did you just do a live fade out? <laughs> yes. So that's just a little message to the boys that are on their alleged vacation. Wow, that was awful. Sometimes you just have to put it in song. 
You know, at some points I thought you were doing a parody, but then it was just an homage. You were just singing line for line. It was a homage, mm. part parody, part homage. And I feel good about it. I can finally walk around in in this office with my head held up high instead of, you know, doing a shame walk. How do you know that song by heart? You're a guy that doesn't even know music, yet that song, you can just sit there. Sometimes I'm like a savant. It's just there. Well, you're an idiot. I don't know about the savant part. All right, so you're all happy and... I'm very happy the way this turned out. Yeah. Wiki said this is a victory for all of us. So he's a... Hmm. Don't ask, don't tell. But later, when it's just me and Earl, I'm going to tell. Don't tell Earl anything. I want to tell. Don't and tell. Don't tell me. It's like that. Earl, don't ask. Don't you ask. Well, I'm telling, Earl. No telling. Keep Why don't your... we just raise eyebrows? I'll just have to spend the rest of the day with you two, so you never get a chance alone to talk. Mm. Curtis, you're on a fez. Hey, what's up? Is old Fezzy drinking again? Sounds like the old Mikey D days. Yeah, my uh, Fezzy gets a little crazy. I'm not going to lie to you. Am I crazy or am I driven to this craziness? I'm Does not... someone just drop me off at Crazy's doorstep? It's not my fault. I don't even know what your metaphors mean. They're insane <laughs> metaphors. Oh, here's our friend Opera Boy. Hey, Opera Boy. Hey, I just wanted to uh, let Fez know that the voice lessons I've been giving him have really paid off. Mm, I think that was a little shot at the way you sing. Yeah. yeah. He's done opera in Cleveland. Mm. Who hasn't? Who you? doesn't? You? Yeah, but it's just uh, I've never been through Cleveland. Cleveland rocks. I've heard that. Cleveland rocks. And sometimes I yell, disco sucks, is the way... Showing those people. All right, Ron and Fez show uh, pulling into a Friday. Uh, here is uh, Andy. Andy, you're on Ron and Fez. Hey, this is Andy. Uh, I'm sorry, but Fez, you, uh, I'm sw I'm a switcher. I'm leaving Team Watley. What? You disgraced me. You're leaving Team Watley. Well, yes. guess what, Andy? I'll somehow survive. Well, you just, you destroyed me. First I was afraid. I was petrified. Kept thinking I could never live without you by my side. But then I spent so many nights thinking how you did me wrong. And I grew strong. I learned how to carry on. And so you're back. All right, that's just, just stop, stop, stop. Stop. What? stop. I can't hear it again. You got to do it once. That was plenty. All right. I mean, you're not going to sing it to Andy. You don't have a beef with him. I'm making a statement towards Andy. Andy thinks Team Watley can't survive without him. Key word. You don't have a dog in that fight. Hmm. Andy's going to find himself on a fuck -o list. Roger, you're on Ronnie Fez. Hey, Ronnie. Thank yeah. you so much for stopping that song. God, I was about to put a gun to my head. Uh... Look I, look, I love you guys. I love O&A. I just want to put all this behind us. And uh, the boys are on vacation now. And uh, I'm Vacation? Sure. Roger, don't be so naive. They're sitting there saying, you know what they're saying? Ramon Fez is a shit dick. Roger, you'll never make it as a pest. That's just <laughs> too fucking hayseed and stupid and southern. Why go through the whole rhythm? <laughs> Try to fucking <laughs> join in with the kids. If I just say the word Ramon. People will like me. Hey, I've got a new organization that's taking me in. I'm a pest now. Uh, Brandon, you're on Ronnie Fez. Ronnie. Yeah. Team Bennington all the way. Fez just turned into a total bag of dick. All right, come on, man. Don't be like that. That's really immature. I'm sorry I don't have your support, Brandon. I'm sorry, but somehow, guess what? I'll learn how to survive. First I was afraid. I was petrified. Kept thinking I could never live without Brandon by my side. I just spent so many nights thinking how you did me wrong. And I grew strong. And I learned how to carry on. And so you're back from outer space. 
I just walked in to find you here with that sad look upon your face. I should have changed that stupid lock. I should have made you leave your key. If I had known for just one second, you'd be back to bother me. Go on now, go. Walk out the door. Get. Just turn around now. Because you're not welcome anymore. Weren't you the one who tried to hurt me with All right, your... it's what? Please stop. Just stop. Just stop. Barely got through the chorus. That's the problem. That's the problem. Todd, you're on Ronnie Fez. Hi, Ronnie Fezzy. Uh, first of all, that John Carr thing, don't we think since he was supposed to be so fascinated with that, that this could have been a shot at his 15 minutes of fame? And secondly... Fezzi, you mentioned the word dignity. Are you not the man who shaved his head blue and spent a week with Elvish? That is true, Fezzi. You have done some low things. It was a whirlwind weekend. It was an entire week. I mean, you act like you are all about dignity. Right. And you have to be treated with dignity. Right. I had to fight for my respect this week. But haven't you licked a man's balls? Mm. Am... Haven't you reamed an <laughs> asshole or two? That has nothing to do with dignity. Aren't you filled with Benoit balls as we speak? What do you know of dignity? I am not filled. I'm a survivor. Don't. Don't what? do it. Don't do it. Hmm. Stop it. Who won? There are no winners. What? What did Guns N' Roses say? What's so civil about a war anyway? Um, personally, I'm willing to forget about this. I'm willing to be the bigger person now uh, that it's been resolved. I hope it doesn't continue on. I hope maybe with some sensitivity training, yeah. Opie and Norton can eventually come back to 202. Hey, did you notice that John Mayer slapped my idea right back in my face about the Encore Radar Love? For it, but uh, Bruce, you're on running Fez. With O and A gone next week, um, what did it test to do with uh, Ron Fez? Fe uh, oh, we're not let Jimmy poke Fez's eye out and skull fuck him. Oh God, these guys are getting. They can't be real pests. They're so yeah. lame. Yeah. Please do me a favor, and when there's an actual thing going on, don't you folks give the calls <laughs> and fucking <laughs> represent. You've got no timing, no ability to do the voice. I'm wondering about being played here because those are not like any pest I've ever heard. Right. They're pussy pest. The puss. That doesn't uh, bother you at all, Fez? Oh, you know what? It really doesn't. It doesn't. You know why? why? Because I can rise above things. Mm -hmm. I've been through adversity before, and I know I can survive. <laughs> First I was afraid, I was petrified, kept thinking I could never live without you by my side. But then I spent so many nights thinking how you did me wrong, and I grew strong, and I learned how to carry on. And so you're back from outer space. I just walked in to find you here about with... Ow! Turn it off. Turn it off. Oh. I gotta have more cowbell. That one really hurt. I mean, you just whipped it at me. Sometimes it's gonna happen. I think a, bri a rib is broken. Don't worry, you're gonna survive. You will survive. Don't do it. Turn it off. You said. I'm picking it back up. You said I would Turn survive. it off. Turn it off. First I was afraid. Stop. Turn it I off. Was, I'm going to fucking smash you with this. Hey, I got to tell you guys this yesterday. I go walking outside. Who's standing in front of our building right around the corner? Tony Bennett. Beautiful. Yeah. Excellent sighting. So I tried to call you back, uh, Fez. I didn't have your... Uh, number. So I called Earl and I go, Hey, Earl, I'm right down on uh, 7th. Uh, Tony Bennett's here. Tell Fez. He goes like this. He's talking with Dave. Click. He hangs up. You're kidding me. Yeah. 
Tony Bennett was down there talking with everybody. He sang a song. It was fucking great. <laughs> um, Earl, I don't care who it is that Ronnie cited. You have permission to interrupt any conversation with me and Eastside Dave. Even if you're talking with Eastside Dave. Yes. Yes, Ronnie could have spotted anyone. Ronnie could have spotted a dime on the sidewalk. <laughs> you interrupt the conversation I'm having with Eastside Dave. Chewed gum? Chewed gum. Interrupt. If there is a dentine sighting there. Hmm. I miss Tony Bennett. Oh, he was great, too. Met everybody, signed autographs, sang. He was fantastic. I hear he's gregarious that way. Uh, Matt, Matt, you're on the Ron and Fez show. Yeah. Yeah. This Matt, uh, Fez, man, I love you, dude, but I don't know what happened between you and Opie, but, uh, you can't rub salt in the wound, man, even if you did. Matt, every time we move on with the conversation, one of you you're hasty right. callers brings it right back to that. You're right. You're right. So I don't want, I want you to hang up and be this. For the whole South. Hang up for the whole South so it doesn't come back up again. We were talking Bye, about a completely different sexual predator. Right. John Carr. Not Opie. This thing is over. It's done. It happened. It's been settled. Mm. There's been a suspension all next week. And, like all these things, one person survived. First I was afraid, I was petrified Kept thinking I could never live without you by my side But then I spent so many nights thinking how you did me wrong And I grew strong, and I learned how to carry on And so you're back, from outer space I just turned, said, ow! I saw you going, ow! Sorry. Keep it off. Keep it off. Oh. God. I don't even know if this hand's moving now. I'm going to tell you something right now, my friend. What? I'm going to end up taking your wallet. Why? What you does that got to do with any of it? The only thing that hurts you is financial pain. That's the only thing that hurts you. If I had one on me, you'd be welcome to it. I'll check your socks. Check those baggy stank socks of yours. Pockets only. You're only allowed to check pockets. Whatever I find, I keep. <laughs> Remember when your friends would say that? <laughs> Whatever I find, I keep. You got any money now? Whatever I find, fuck you. Get away from me. <laughs> You're not going through my pockets to check. I'm not a treasure hunt. Drives you crazy. Uh, any ball games on this weekend? Anything happening in the sports world? Uh, Jay. Jay, you're on running Fez. Hey, buddy. I just wanted to uh, kind of voice my support for Fez, and I wanted to ask him if he felt uh, vindicated with the whole thing, and, and probably this isn't going to go beyond, you know, this weekend. All right. I, yeah, uh, Fez, I mean, I, I want to drop this thing between you and Opie, but his question was, do you feel vindicated? That's a very good question that Jay had, and yes, I do feel vindicated because I didn't know if I was going to make it through this week. It's been a long week, and somehow I was able to survive. First I was afraid, I was petrified Kept thinking I could never live without you by my side But then I spent so many nights thinking how you did me wrong And I grew strong, and I learned how to carry on And so you're back, from outer space I just walked in to find you here with that sad look upon your face I should have changed that stupid lock I should have made you leave your key If I had known for just one second You'd be back here, OB Go on now, go! Walk out the door Just turn around now Cause you're not welcome anymore Weren't you the one who tried to hurt me with goodbye? You think I'd crumble? You think I'd lay down and die? Oh no, not I! I will survive Oh, as long as I know how to love I know I'll stay alive I've got all my life to live And I've got all my love to give And I'll survive 
I will survive. Hey, hey! Right here, standing here surviving. I'm not just someone that you can just take and bend over some couch anytime you feel like it. Get it? It's not happening. It's not going down that way. It took all the strength I had not to fall apart. Kept trying hard to mend the pieces of my oh so broken heart. And I spent oh so many nights just feeling sorry for myself. I used to cry. And now I hold my head up high. And now you see me on 202. I'm not that chained up little person still in love with Hughes. And so you felt like dropping in and just expect me to be free. And now I'm saving all my loving for someone named Anthony. Go on now, go! Walk out the door. Just turn around, Norton. Cause you're not welcome anymore. Weren't you the one who tried to hurt me with all your pain? You think I crumble? You think I lay down for monster rain? Oh no, not I. I will survive. Ow! Oh, oh, oh. 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 Oh, oh